Hey, aren't you safe? Yeah, Get your bow on. No. Get your card again. No. Get your old sock on the floor. Get your no. old clothes on the back of the chair. Tights? You like your tights, don't you? It's looking a bit scruffy now. You're looking yeah. forward to getting it off. Yeah. What's it feel like now? It feels weak. Look how dirty you are. Apparently, this is pretty good because some people, some boys can actually get things in it and yeah. really dirty, really, really dirty brown hands. Charlie's got his cast off. We've taken him back to school. I'm on my phone again because I left my other one. Uh, I left my camera behind. Sophie is eating a ball. Where did you get your ball, Soph? <laughs> is that from your party bag? From your party? A party? From the Mine. party? It is yours, isn't it? Where did Ollie go? Did Ollie go to the doctor? You're not talking? But yeah, we've been to the hospital, had the cast off. He's been told that he's not allowed to do street dance lessons after school today, which he's a bit disappointed about, but he's allowed to go next week. And we have chicken food now, as well as dog food and cat food, because Jack went in the shop for chicken food and came out with dog food. Okay, I look so tired and washed out. I am back on my phone because it's just with me. It's easier. Um, I need to carry my camera around more. I've been carrying my camera around really, really well, but... It's just not happened the last couple of days. But I am still filming, so I'm not using it as an excuse. Uh, the boys... Reese went to percussion club this week because Ollie normally goes to street dance. But Ollie didn't go to street dance today because he had his plaster cast taken off and the doctor told him not to do street dance today. He needed to wait till next week. So I still ended up having to go in at 3 o'clock and having to go in at 4 o'clock to pick up individually. So fingers crossed for next week that it actually goes to plan and I don't have to pick up either child till four o'clock. Bruce has got to be in his wellies and his jeans tomorrow because they're going rock pooling. I need to remember, which is more why I'm telling you, to remind myself. I need to put a note on the table or something tonight so I see it. Maybe on the door, something like that, so I see it. But then I need to remember to read it. And I'm cooking the biggest steak in the world. Jack thought it was a steak or no, a bag full of steaks when he got it out of the freezer and it turns out it's not, it's just one two inch deep steak. So I don't know quite what's going to happen with that. I've got to divide it up somehow. See? A moon! How did they go? You saw the moon when you were walking the dogs? Yeah? Is it round? Yes. Is it yellow? Yes. Is it dark outside? Yes. This is the size of the steak, so I have cut it in half. That's Jack's bit. It's my bit. I don't know how much it'd weigh, but it is a massive steak. But yeah, I totally had the smaller bit of steak, and look at it next to my hand. It's like hand size. I don't think I'm going to be able to eat all my steak.